Hey, this is a uh, start of a painting here, a sailboat, uh, uh, sailboats on the beach in the surf. Now, these sailboats I'm going to show, I've transferred this to a uh, piece of uh, Gemini 140-pound watercolor paper, and I've drawn the sketch here. But I'm going to use uh, Frisket film. The Frisket film comes in a, in a pad, a, a 9 by 12 uh, and it comes in sheets, sheet sizes. And what you can do is cut these down into uh, cut off pieces of them uh, to make them easier to handle. And what I've done here is taken one little piece, and a trick I've learned is that you can take uh, some scotch tape. And put a piece on the back and a piece on the front of it, and then you pull it apart like this in order to take it apart, in order to take it off the off the backing. And you save the backing here so you can put it back on, and it's also almost like a piece of uh, wax paper. Then you take the you take the frisket foam and then you put it, place it over. The object, I'm going to use this one right here. And line it up on one side, one edge. And then I take an X Acto knife, which has a sharp blade. Take an X Acto knife, and then I'm going to follow. And just very lightly cut the shape and then pull off the excess. Okay. Now, this section here now has been uh, protected by brisket film. I've covered all these areas, these sails, with the frisket film, and I mixed up uh, actually three colors of blue. I got ultramarine blue up here, uh, cobalt blue, and cerulean blue down here, a lighter blue. So that's the blue of the sky, and I'm going to take uh, a bristle brush, a two-inch bristle brush, with just water. I'm going to pre-wet the sky. That makes the uh, paint. Helps make the paint uh, move a little smoother. It's a little bit of wet on wet here. Get nice and wet up to the horizon line. And then with my three quarter inch natural hair brush loaded, put in the sky color, a little bit darker at the top. And as I come down, a little bit lighter, we use cobalt blue down. And then toward the horizon. Uh, now I'm going to go right across those sails. Close to those sails that were protected with the brisket film. And then go up here a little bit darker, a little bit darker up here in the corner. That dry. Okay, now we'll take off the uh, frisket film. I've got my frisket folder here, and uh, inside my frisket folder, uh, I've got a piece of uh, wax paper that I've just uh, taped on here, and I'm going to use that to uh, put the pieces. So I take the X Acto knife and go under an edge very carefully. 
don't want to scratch the paper. Just pick up a, a corner and pull it off. Now go over here and put it on the wax paper. And this one here, so pick up an edge, peel it off on the wax paper. <clears throat> so just taking the X Acto knife and going underneath the, the edge very carefully. Pick up the edge, get it started, and lift it off. Yeah, one more. Put on wax paper. And if you put on the wax paper, it can be used again. So if you want to do another painting, the same subject, try it again. Then you you have your you have your frisket film already cut and ready put it right back on so it's reusable. This graphics product of frisket foam is very useful. I use it in a lot of my art, not only just to cover up small areas like today's demonstration, but in larger spaces to cover it up to protect the painting and to and to protect the white paper. Now, all these supplies you see today are available on my website everswatercolors.com. Subscribe to my channel and be aware of my next video coming down the road. See you in the next video.